Review of a, uh, a, uh, a, uh, and o oh sounds. These sounds are frequently confused. Non-native speakers sometimes do not clearly distinguish the difference between cup and cop and cap and cope. The a、uh、sound. Remember, the a、uh、sound, as in fun or cup, is a neutral vowel, meaning that everything in your mouth is relaxed and the lips are just very slightly open. The a、uh、and the a、uh、sounds. In contrast to the a,、uh, the a、uh、and the a、uh、sounds, as in father and saw, require the mouth to be open. A、uh、and a、uh、are very similar sounds, except for the a,、uh, the lips are a little bit more oval in shape and the tongue is slightly tense. However, in many parts of the United States, the a、uh、and a、uh、are pronounced the same. For example, many Americans pronounce hot and tall with the same vowel sound. The o、oh、sound. For the o、oh、sound, as in boat, the lips are rounded and tense. Warning: dangerous mistakes. Confusing a,、uh, 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 and o、oh、can cause embarrassment or can be offensive. Do you mean Doug or dog? Also, mispronouncing words like Coke, focus, fork, and folk can cause you to say an inappropriate or offensive word. Vowel contrast dialogue for a,、uh, 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 and o.、Oh. Coffee tomorrow. Hi, Nicole. Can you talk? Oh hi, John. Can you hold on? I'm on another call. I'm talking to my boss. No problem. I'll wait till you're done. Okay, now I can talk. I'm sorry it took so long. What's going on? Nothing much. I just wanted to know if we can meet for lunch or coffee tomorrow. Oh, that sounds like fun. I've been working nonstop, and I'd love to get out of the office. The problematic O, words spelled with the letter O, can cause many frustrations for students of the American accent. You have already learned that the pronunciation of a vowel doesn't necessarily correspond to the spelling of the vowel. This is especially true of the letter O. The letters O in the words job, love, and only are all pronounced differently. Here is a quote by Helen Keller, which contains fourteen different words spelled with the letter O, and has all three different vowel pronunciations. You will hear the quote twice. First. Just listen. The second time you hear it, you will have a chance to repeat. When one door of happiness closes, another opens. But often we look so long at the closed door that we do not see the one which has opened for us. When one door of happiness closes, another opens. But often we look so long at the closed door that we do not see the one which has opened for us. First, let's look at the most problematic sound with an O spelling. It's the neutral sound a,、uh, as in love. Other and Monday, which non-native speakers frequently mispronounce as love, other, and Monday. The wrong pronunciation occurs because the a、uh、sound doesn't exist in some languages, and also because learners are used to this sound usually being spelled with the letter u, as in up, fun, and Sunday. You will improve your American accent if you simply memorize some very common words with the a、uh、sound that are spelled with an o. O U, or even sometimes a double O. Memorizing the exceptions: words spelled with O but pronounced as a,、uh, above.
another. Brother. Color. Cover. Come. Does. Done. Dove. From. Gonna. Love. Monday. Money. Month. Mother. None. Nothing. Of. Once. One. Other. Oven. Some. Something. Somewhere. Sun. Ton. Tongue. One. Wonderful. Words spelled with an O-U and pronounced as a. Uh. Double. Country. Couple. Tough. Douglas. Cousin. Enough. Touch. Rough. Southern. Words spelled with a double O and pronounced as a. Uh. Blood. Flood. Word spelled with the letter A, pronounced with the A uh sound. What. Was. The American AW uh sound. In American English, the AW uh sound, as in caught and all, is very similar to the AW uh sound, as in want and hot. In fact, these two sounds, AW uh and A, uh, are so similar in many parts of the United States that some language experts even claim that they're the same sound. So, while going through these lessons, if you're not able to clearly distinguish between these two vowels, don't worry about it. Neither can many native speakers of American English. Warning, common mistake. If you studied English outside of the United States, you might have learned British pronunciation. The vowel sound that is most noticeably different between British and American English is the AW. In British English, this sound is much more rounded, almost like the O. The words coat and caught sound similar in British English, but as you have learned, they're very different in American English. Let's practice pronouncing the differences between the two sounds A and O. Sentences for practice for A and O. We all thought that Joe went to Rome. I bought some clothes at the mall. The audience applauded when the show was over. Paul is going home in August. We're going for a walk even though it's cold. The author wrote his autobiography. Study tip. Have you ever heard Americans speak your native language? Practice imitating their accent. This will help you to get in touch with the American mouth movements and sounds. For example, when Americans speak Spanish, you will notice that they often prolong the Spanish O oh into an O oh sound. Hola amigo often sounds like hola amigo, or my friends Ricardo and Roberto sound like my friends Ricardo and Roberto. A similar vowel change often occurs when Americans speak French. The vowel E eh, ends up sounding like A. Eh. Je vais au marché can sound like je vais au marché. So, when you speak English, prolong these vowels the same way and you'll be on the right track. <laughs>